Then we'll make a chutney thing. That haven't been used. But we'll make a chutney thing all by itself. <laughs> okay. One that can use chutney, but this is not meant for chutney, so. <laughs> Hello, this is Not a Spring Chick, and today on Cooking with Not a Spring Chick, we're going to be making gourmet baked beans. Or actually, gourmet beans, right? It, 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 it's beans and franks. Ah. Uh, we're making baked. I you know, baked beans and franks. And they're laughing because I keep on saying, I want to use a chutney. They're going, why do you want to keep using the chutney? I'm thinking, because we're cleaning out the cupboards and I have three jars of chutney in the cupboard and I haven't figured out what to do with it. We're used for whatever chutney is used for to make something. I think why, it's should like we just put it on the spread? You no, know, I think what you do is you make like a chutney pie or something. I don't know. Uh, we're going to recreate chutney to I'll figure out else. what is good for it. I know it tastes bad. So anyway, so. on the beans and franks, you're going to notice a few things. We have some carrot, corn syrup or carol syrup, as they often call. This one, I'm going to tell you. It was hard like a rock. Yeah, they're not exactly intended to go in the microwave like this. Ours was, as you said, ours was rock because it's been there open for so long. And of course, we don't want to waste it. Oh, and it didn't do well when I put it in hot water. Oh, it didn't? Okay, see the bend on the bottom, that isn't from the microwave, that's from the hot water. Oh, it did. The microwave oh. didn't do it, but it microwaved quite well. It did not hot water at all. See, we have, of course, Frank's, I know. It looks like the Lane Tower pizza. I know. Um, can, we, can we get these small? Whatever size you want to slice them in. But I mean, it's amazing that uh, that hot water can do that to a plastic container, right? And then the microwave did nothing. Really? I put it in the micro. it's boiling in the microwave and it comes out exactly like it looked when I went in. But see, it's it's going to be sort of heavy on hot dog because I'm hungry. That's okay because I like hot dogs and I'm also thinking, I don't know if I want them little, I think I want big ones. No, big ones, this is beans and franks. This is beans and franks, they can go big ones. Now you gotta okay. just chop up her onion. onions. Okay, now, I'm, oh, we have wine. Yeah. Why is it going to go oh, in? Oh, we have this. I thought we didn't have it. No, that's this, the new one. Oh, okay. This happens to be from Virgin Wines. You know Virgin Airways? They yeah. actually have a wine company. Somebody, what it was, somebody had a magic mic party with my wine supply. Uh-huh. Yeah, I mean, there's a whole brand new bottle over on my left side, too. It's already two-thirds empty in one night. Mm -hmm. Because they, okay, we'll put it this way. There is a cook in this place besides not a spring chick, and then he, her family member uses wine all the time to cook with. Mm -hmm. Lots of wine. Got all the good wine. <laughs> That's why oh, I want to put more things in here. Now, I, it's like, I don't think I've ever, can I just pour all this in here? Well, yeah, just, just okay. lift the whole thing up and dump it in. Like. I don't think I've ever had beans and franks. What does the carol syrup do to this? I, I, I don't have brown sugar. Oh, we do have brown sugar. No, I don't have brown sugar. Uh -huh. You've got the other stuff. We have brown syrup, sugar down underneath. I know, but, but that's I mean, okay. Since we've already made that. No, like but that. I needed to get rid of that. Yeah, I, I've we did. had this stuff setting for like half a year. Yeah. So let's okay. just dump that in. It's hot. <laughs> um, I just got it out of the microwave. But All look, of it? See how, yeah, look how easy that pours now that it was hot. It, it was like a rock. You see, you want to do is mix it all up. Okay. So I don't know if we need the other one, but the other one has been sitting there. At the, but I would put it this way. It's been sitting there since November. Oh, we okay. got it. We, we yeah open since November. Oh, and it happens to be what month? September. Yeah, because we bought it for Christmas cooking. Okay. And we since if you can figure it this way, if we got it for Christmas cooking, we didn't buy it in November. We probably bought it in September. That's true. Okay, Ken, I put the carol syrup in there. I know. Oh, we have to put this in here. Some wine in there. Okay. Carol syrup is uh, the how much? Well, I don't Just know, an inch bit. or so. An inch. Yeah. It's probably oh, an inch. I don't remember where it started. Yeah, I was oh, at the bottom. Of that. No, it's probably enough. <laughs> it's so right here. Okay, then just mix it all together. Okay. So do you want me to get brown sugar added? No, to I don't need I don't? the brown sugar. I just got rid of my my Cairo syrup. This is just a, 
Are we supposed to cover it? I poured that whole container in there and there's all this stuff in there. No, you just mix it up and you know, you put it in the microwave and let it boil. It smells really Come good. to a boil. That's it, folks. It smells really, really good. I know, it's really simple to do. Well, first of all, the beans are already pre cooked, the hot dogs are really pre cooked, and the only thing you're doing is boiling them. You're boiling the, it because you want to burn off the alcohol. Yeah, the so wine. put it on for like any? three minutes on high. So, I know. Ooh, she went down. There you go. It's probably boiling this time. Oh, it smells really good. Yeah. It, it oh. should be ready. I think it's ready. Get it out and then it's going to be... Remember, it's hot when you bite into it. Okay. So, <laughs> she's losing her top. So, it's one of the few bandeau tops that we have that she actually can wear. We got two, actually, don't we? Yeah. This one and the other one, so. Yeah. I know. And then you just get yourself um, a little. Then she's totally wound up. What? Now it's all ready to eat. What? I know. She's, she gets, she's in a goofy mood. Well, I can guarantee you the reason, another second reason why is... Uh, she had omelet. This, that was it today. That was hours ago. So oh yeah, I need to eat. Now. You need to eat when she okay. she has to get sugar in her. So now you just get your little spoon, spoon, and this isn't spoon. Out I know. Much. I think I get a one of the bigger ones out. I don't know why. See, this isn't really, we're not really caring about the broth, we're just caring about the food. Ooh, yeah, why don't I add some broth in there too? I mean, it's got to be yeah, good bean really broth. It's like really good. And it's like... <laughs> I know, she's hungry. It's really good. She gets silly when she needs sugar. Mm. I think it's hypoglycemic. You don't want to see her when she's going off of being sugar high because she hits the sugar low. Mm. And mm. it's really a sad thing to see. You know, then she becomes her real age, 79. <laughs> she does that? Mm. You like that? Very good. Yep. Very, very, very good. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> I'm getting into my food. <laughs> she likes to eat. Okay, gourmet beans and franks. Yes, you can do it too. It's as easy as. Okay, it is actually pretty easy. <laughs> I think part of it is thinking of adding the contents together. It's whatever you got. Um, but it's really good. We we had onion. We had hot dogs. Although somebody did steal two of my dogs last night. And then there's there's organic, a god awful organic Vandalia onions in there. Vandalias? Which, which you'd probably get killed if we took part with one of them. So Oh, these are really good. Well see you're gonna have to have some too. You can make this at home. It's really easy. And um, There's no time to it. We use two hot dogs. I, I put right. four. We had four hot dogs? We had four hot dogs in there. Oh yeah, okay. So I forgot I wasn't counting. Okay, four hot dogs, the quality of the hot dogs depends on your personal preferences. Yep. What type of hot dogs depends on your personal preferences. Or you can use sausages. Yeah, sausages. Anything you want to put in it. Sausages work really well too. Yep. But we had hot dogs. Of course they were Farmer John hot dogs. They were pretty good. Okay, beans and franks, you can do it too. In the microwave, gourmet style, not your regular like out of the can style. Um, it just makes a difference. See? And serve this like well, if you serve it in small containers um, with the other food then it'll look like it's gourmet yeah <laughs> Isn't that the or you can serve it on top of a lettuce base or something oh actually that would be good too oh what if you put it over mashed potatoes yep oh that would be good okay now i'm thinking okay anyway i gotta go eat bon appetit enjoy